In this video, you're going to learn a lot of new words and examples, all in English, no Arabic. Not only will you understand it, you'll also love it. And soon enough, this is going to be your favorite way of learning English. And hey, remember, I promised you that I will give you a very important advice in this lesson. I'm going to keep my promise. And at the end of this video, I'm going to give you this very important advice. And don't worry, I will be speaking a lot slower. You'll understand. Stay tuned. Assalamu alaikum everybody, this is Ibrahim and you're watching the American English on YouTube. Before we start, let me use this chance to congratulate you on your bravery. You have the guts to try something new. You weren't afraid to push yourself out of your comfort zone. Trust me, I know how scary this could be, but there you are. You're not scared. You're here. Not everybody is able to do that. And hey, remember, people say, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Look at you, here you are. You're sitting down watching an English-only video and that didn't scare you away. Not everybody is capable of doing that. And that, my friend, is a first step towards your success in learning English. In this video, you'll be working all your English skills at once. You'll be practicing listening, reading, and speaking. And at the end of this video, you will already have learned a lot of new words. Don't only count the new words you learned. Count the time that you spent practicing all your listening skills, your reading skills, and your speaking skills. Before you start, I want you to know your level now. And after a few videos, measure your level once again and see if you'll be surprised. So enough blabbing. Are you ready to learn English? Let's get started. And remember, I said no Arabic. Don't write anything in Arabic today. Let's get started. The first word we have today is disabled 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 can you say that disabled look at this picture this man is disabled the man is disabled the woman is disabled the woman is disabled the dog is disabled the dog is disabled Please don't translate anything in your head into Arabic. Just forget about Arabic. Forget it. Don't think in Arabic with me. Look at the picture. Say the English sentence. Let's do it. The dog is disabled. The dog is disabled. The man is disabled. The man is disabled. The woman is disabled. The woman is disabled. Now, you say, I show you the pictures, you say English. Ready? Now, this is a wheel. Wheel. Can you say, wheel. Wheel. Now, this car has four wheels. This car has four wheels. Now, let's make a few sentences. The car has four wheels. The car has four wheels. What about this? This is a bicycle. Bicycle by bicycle. Bicycle. The bicycle has two wheels. The bicycle has two wheels. What about the bus? The bus has four wheels. The bus has four wheels. Hey, wait, stop, stop. You understand English. You understand English. You didn't use Arabic. I didn't speak Arabic. You understand. Great job. Stay like that. Don't go back to studying in Arabic. I'm very proud of you. Let's keep going. Now, look at this picture. What is that? It's a chair, isn't it? A chair. But look again. This chair has wheels. This chair has wheels. This chair has four wheels. This is not a chair. Not a chair. This is a wheelchair. A wheelchair. A wheelchair. Can you repeat it? A wheelchair. Now, Look at these pictures and repeat the sentences with me. 
the disabled man, remember, disabled man, the disabled man is sitting in a wheelchair, in a wheelchair. The disabled man is sitting in a wheelchair. The disabled woman is sitting in a wheelchair. The bus, the bus has four wheels. The bicycle has two wheels. The bicycle has two wheels. Now, it's your turn. Next word we have is together, 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 one, one, together. Can you say together? The man and the woman are walking together. The man and the woman are walking together. The boy and the girl are walking together. The boy and the girl are walking together. How about the children? The children are playing together. The children are playing together. The bicycle has two wheels. The disabled man is sitting in a wheelchair. Okay, so this is together. Together. No together. No together is alone. Alone. Can you say it? Alone. The man is sitting alone. The man is sitting alone. The man is walking alone. No walking. No g, g No walking. 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 The man is walking alone. Look at this girl. Is she happy? No. She's sad. Sad. She doesn't like to eat alone. She doesn't like to eat alone. The girl is eating alone. The girl is eating alone. Now this is a goalkeeper. 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 What is the goalkeeper doing? The goalkeeper is catching the ball. The goalkeeper is catching the ball. Catch. Catch. What about the dog? The dog is catching a bone. 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 O. O. Bone. The dog is catching a bone. How about the cat? The cat is catching a fish. The cat is catching a fish. Let's have a revision. The man is sitting alone. The goalkeeper is catching the ball. The man is walking alone. The girl is eating alone. The dog is catching a bone. The man and the woman are walking together. The car has four wheels. The disabled man is sitting in a wheelchair. The cat is catching a fish. Next word is clean. Can you say it? Clean. Look at this picture. Two cars. The white car is clean. The blue car is not clean. Dirty. Dirty. The white car is clean. The blue car is dirty. Look at this woman. What is she doing? She is cleaning. Cleaning. Don't say cleaning. G no, g. Cleaning. She's cleaning. The students are cleaning the classroom. The students are cleaning the classroom. Classroom. The man is cleaning the desk. The man is cleaning the dirty car. The man is cleaning the dirty car. Now listen, I will show you 11 pictures and I will speak the sentences as I am showing them to you. After I am done, it'll be your turn. I will be quiet and I show you the pictures and I want you to say the full sentences. You will be able to, don't worry. Here we go. The disabled man is sitting in a wheelchair. The disabled woman is sitting in a wheelchair. 
The bus has four wheels. The bicycle has two wheels. The man and the woman are walking together. The boy and the girl are walking together. The children are playing together. The man is sitting alone. The man is walking alone. The students are cleaning the classroom. The man is cleaning the dirty car. Now you say the sentences. Ready? Now it's time for the important advice that I promised you. Remember, without applying this advice, you might not even be able to see any progress in your language learning. You must speak to yourself in English at least 10 minutes a day. No mirror, no recordings, no specific time, no specific topic. Just you and yourself talk. Even if you have nothing in your mind you want to talk about, talk. Force yourself to speak for at least 10 minutes a day. Do that every day, on a happy day, on a sad day, on a busy day, on a free day. Do it every day and don't stop. After a few weeks of doing this, you will be able to see the difference in your level. Now, as we come to the end of this video, did you understand the new words and their examples? Trust me, this is the only way you should be learning English. Please don't go back to learning English words translated into your own language. That would not benefit you. Now, if you want the next video to be longer and include more words and more examples, please do let me know in the comments below. Should you have any other suggestion for me, please do not hesitate dropping me a line. And if you didn't subscribe yet, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and do that now so I can see you in the next video. Thank you for watching everyone. I'll see you in the next video. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.